Hi guys, this is Rena here, and today I'll be doing a short video review um, on this dog collar that you see here in the background. Um, I ordered the smallest size they have, which is a small, as you can see it even says small. So this is supposed to fit a small dog. And um, I really think this is pretty big. I think they should have had like an extra small size, because to me, this is super small. But, I mean, this is super huge, actually, not small. Um, I don't have a dog, but my neighbor does, um, and I was going to give this to her or put it on my cat, but it's way too big to fit either of them. Um, I have an extremely large cat, but it's still even way too big for my 23 pounder, so, um, this, it, I was a little disappointing because I'm not going to be able to use it, but it does light up. It's an LED collar. And I do apologize, guys, for all the noise in the background, so I'm just going to try to talk as loud as I can. And I'll shut the lights so that you can see this. So it glows very bright, and there's a few different modes to this. So this is just the standard. And then there's a pulsating um, feature. And this one doesn't change colors. It only is blue, but they do have other color options, which I'll tell you about in a minute. And this is the flashing and then off. So those are the separate modes that they have. One really cool thing about this though, is instead of always needing to replace the battery, it does have a little charging port right here and it comes with like a USB charger. So you would just plug this in right here. So I thought that was awesome. That was like an amazing feature. I was super excited about that. And then you would just have to have a base piece. Like if you have like a block for your iPhone or something, you could just plug that into there and you'll be all set. And it is really easy to find. It just plugs into this little port right here by the battery. Right there. That's it. Um, so it did come with this about the product and... um. You know, how to use it and all that. So, let me just, instead of reading off of that, I will read from my notes here to tell you guys more about this. So, they have six colors. And for colors, they have the blue, obviously. They have green, lime, which is a lighter green. They have a multicolored one, which is all the colors together. And they have a pink and a red. So, the small right here is 11 to 16 inches, which it looks way bigger than that. Um, the medium is 13 to 19 inches, and the large is 15 to 23. So, just so you guys see, this is the small. So, you might want to order a size down depending on how big your dog is. Um, but that, to me, would not seem like it would fit a small dog. Because when I think small dog, I think, like, small. Um, when I think medium dog, I'm thinking, like, of, like, a pug or something like that. So, um, this is probably more for, like, a, the size of, like, a pug or a poodle and not necessarily, like, a small, like, terrier or something like that. So, that's what I think of when I think of small. Um, so it takes 30 minutes to charge. And, once again, I apologize for all the noise in my backyard, but I have to record these today. And it's getting late, and unfortunately, they're apparently not going inside anytime soon. Um, so you get 10 hours of light per charge, which is pretty good because that would be, like, the whole day. Um, but then you would have to charge it every day, so, you know, that is a little annoying. But um, you could only, like, charge this up and then put it on for your early morning walks or your night walks. So that wouldn't be so bad. Um, 30 minutes of charge and 10 hours battery. So this would be great, of course, like I mentioned, for the early morning walks or late at night when it's dark so that you can still see. Um, one thing I did love about this product is 100% of the profits go to Dogs in Need, which goes for a company called Shine for Dogs. And um, it is durable and weatherproof, which is nice. Like I showed you, it has three different modes and... And there are six different colors. And the cost of this is $18.95, which is a little high for a dog collar, in my opinion. But since it goes to charity, I think it's definitely worth it. And if you guys have any questions about this product or about um, anything, you guys can feel free to leave me a comment in the 
you know, leave me a question or comments down below and I'm more than happy to help you or write back and I appreciate every time someone leaves me feedback so thanks for that and please subscribe and if you do thank you in advance and bye for now guys